professional. Well, I scored my first feature about eight years later after film school, right? Okay. So, so that was about 2008, and that's when I really feel like things really kind of started. So it's probably about 15, 16 years, something like that. What was your first? What was the first? It was an Australian film. I'm from Australia. So it was an Australian film called The Black Balloon. And it did really well. It won a bunch of Australian Academy Awards. So it was like straight off the bat, I was thrown into it. Nice. That's amazing. Um, blind spotting. Tell me about blind spotting a little bit. What exactly is that? And then how your music fits in with that? Film? So, yeah. So, blind spotting was a film in 2018. It opened Sundance. Uh, it's basically set in Oakland. It's a film about Oakland. It's a love letter to Oakland. Uh, and it's, um, it's, it's, it's a film that sort of bends genre and, and it, 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 you know, the characters are talking and suddenly they're talking in poetry. You know, there's dance thrown into it. There's, it it's sort of, it's a real celebration of the art of creativity, not just filmmaking. And then uh, the film did so well that they made a television series where they kind of shifted to the focus to a different character, to um, Jasmine Cephas Jones's character. She's the star of the show. Okay. Um, Raphael Cazal and David Diggs are still there as showrunners. Raphael Cazal is in the show. And again, similar thing. So like, there's poetry in the show. There's dance. There's choreography. There's music. There's songs. There's score. It's it's like a real celebration of Oakland. A real celebration of art. And then the music kind of fits in somehow into right. all of that, right? So so we're scoring choreography. Like we're writing music for dance. We're writing music for drama because it gets really heavy. And then all of a sure. sudden we're writing music for comedy because it's suddenly it's funny <laughs> it's it's tough <laughs> i was gonna say i think that's a little bit difficult but it is tough but it's a lot of fun so has there ever been an experience where you had this idea of a music score that you had for a scene and then you see it play out in front of you and you're like oh I need to change that and do it this way. <laughs> all the time, all the time. Because you know, the thing is, you get a script, right? And you're like, like I'm terrible. I seem to be terrible with scripts because I read it. I'm like, I know exactly what this is. I know like exactly. You already have an idea. I like exactly. I'm like, this is going to be this kind of music and blah blah blah. And then you see the film and it's like, oh, this is why I'm not a director <laughs> because because they brought this vision and this I could never have foreseen. Like you know, this is so creative and so different. I never thought the script would translate into this. You know, yeah. and, and then you see, and I and the music that I was thinking before, that's not going to work. It's like, not going to work. Is, yeah. Do you have anything coming up that you're doing that you're working on right now that you can? Uh, nothing really that I can say just yet, but um, but right. um, but right. yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Yeah. All right, Michael. Thank you so much.